Science is fun! With the coronavirus COVID-19 currently raging around the world, you might have heard a lot of people reminding you to wash your hands with soap. But why soap? What is so special about soap? Let's get to that and find out why! Here, I have a set up of three identical bowls, all filled with plain water. Let's pretend our first bowl is teeming with billions of germs. And to do so, I will add some oil and pepper into it. I use oil because essentially, oil is fat, which is the building block of bacteria and most viruses, including the new coronavirus. But because oil is transparent, I'm enlisting the help of pepper, so as to make sure you can all see it. The second bowl will be left unchanged with just pure water. As for the third one, I will add some soap and give it a good stir. Now, I will dip two of my fingers into this bowl with nasty germs. Ugh! Lots of pepper and oil, which means lots of microorganisms stuck to my finger. Quick! I need to wash my hands now! So, I will try and wash one finger with plain water and the other one with water and soap. Let's see what happens. Wow! After three seconds, the one washed with soap is already clean. And the one washed with water is still dirty. Even after 30 seconds, it is still dirty. Well, so why soap is so efficient in getting rid of those nasty germs? Well, it's simple. It's science. As you know, oil and water are not the best of friends. They don't really mix together. That's because oil molecules are hydrophobic, which means they don't like water. They repel water. That's why when I tried to wash my oily finger in water only, it didn't really work. Soap mixed with water, on the other hand, worked incredibly fast. Soap's secret power lies in its dual nature. The head of the soap molecule is hydrophilic. It loves water. It is attracted to water. While its tail is hydrophobic. Just like oil, it fears water, with their heads attracted to water, while the water-shunning tails link up with oils and fats and wedge themselves into the lipid envelopes of certain microbes and viruses, ripping them apart. It is this hybrid structure that renders soap molecules their super ability to kill germs. I hope you enjoyed this short presentation about soap and I've learned something new today. Thank you for watching. Bye!